In today's video, I'm going to teach you how to add columns after column Z in Google Sheets. If you've ever been puzzled about how to extend your spreadsheet beyond the last visible column, you're in the right place. It's simpler than you might think, so let's dive right in and get started. First, you'll want to open your Google Sheets document where you intend to add the new columns. Navigate to column Z, which is the last column in the standard setup of Google Sheets. To begin the process, click on the letter Z at the top of the column. This action selects the entire column Z row from top to bottom, preparing for the modification to take place. Once you have column Z selected, you need to decide how many new columns you want to add. If you're looking to add five columns, for example, it involves a simple but important step using your mouse. Click and hold at column Z, then drag your selection to the left across the adjacent five columns, starting from column Z and ending at the fifth column to its right. As a guide, you'd stop dragging when you've reached column 5, ensuring you have selected columns Z to Phi, representing five columns in total. With the desired number of columns highlighted, now it's time to take action. Move your mouse cursor over your selected area and give it a right click. This action brings up a context menu with various options for what you can do with your selection. To achieve our goal, you're going to look for and click on the option that says Insert Columns Right. This command tells Google Sheets to create new columns immediately to the right of the ones you have selected. And just like that, you'll see your spreadsheet update immediately, with those extra columns appearing right where you needed them. This new space can be a great asset if you're looking to expand your dataset or require additional room for more information. And to recap, remember that the key steps involve selecting the column Z, determining how many new columns you'll need by dragging over the corresponding number of columns, right-clicking on your selection, and choosing Insert Columns Right from the menu. That's really all there is to it. Adding columns in Google Sheets beyond the initial setup isn't restricted, and knowing how to do this allows for greater flexibility in managing every aspect of your data. Whether you need one additional column or multiple, you've now got the power to expand your workspace with just a few clicks. Thanks for watching, and I hope this tutorial makes your spreadsheet tasks a little easier. 